Hey everybody, welcome to Cooking with Karen. Today we're gonna do something simple and it's gonna be breakfast burritos, okay? What's nice about this is you can make these burritos up ahead of time, throw them in the freezer and then pop them out in the mornings. Um, to, well, right now I'm working on one for my sister, so you know what that means, right? Veggies. And um, so uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish cutting up the stuff and um, I, I have spinach, I have bacon, mushrooms, onions and peppers, ham and sausage, eggs, of course, and broccoli. Um, now, uh, um, I, I, it looks like a lot, yes, because I'm making extras. And, uh, and I'll pop them in the freezer or I'll send them to work with my sister, one or the other. Um, so anyways, I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, we're back. Um, uh, I'm gonna do a veggie, uh, like a veggie omelet, okay? So I have bacon grease. I don't like to throw nothing out, but I fried up some bacon. So I'm gonna use a little bacon um, grease. That's all right, she'll eat it. She even said that, well, maybe you could put a little couple pieces of bacon in there because she saw that I fried it, like damn near burnt it. But anyways, she says, okay, I'll try some of that. All right, so what I'm gonna do is she wants a little of everything. So I'm just gonna put a couple um, peppers in, some onions, okay? That's it. Now, if you want, you can cook this up all ahead of time and then take what you want out. Um, I didn't do that because um, I'm making different ones. So uh, that's the reason. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to give this a, a quick cook. I'll put a little salt and pepper in there. Okay, and then I'm going to put, she wants some mushrooms, so I'm going to throw a couple mushrooms in. Now this is all going to go into a burrito, so be careful about how much um, stuff you put in, okay? Because um, it'll probably end up, you're going to be making two burritos instead of one uh, by the time you're done. Okay, I'm going to wait on this. This is the spinach and the, and the broccoli. Let me get something I can start stirring this up with. Okay, hey, I'm a cook like you guys. You gotta have fun with it, okay? Always remember, have fun while you're cooking. Okay, I'm gonna add the spinach. It's, it's real, it's, it's actually pretty quick. I mean, it may not seem that way, but when you do a bunch of them, and, and then you just throw them in the freezer, you know, hey, get up in the morning, pop one in the microwave, it's perfect. Um, okay. It's getting there. Okay, so I'm going to let this cook for a couple seconds. Well, maybe another minute or two. And instead of keeping you here, I'm going to leave for a second and then I'll be right back, okay? Two burritos right here. Two burritos. Get that sizzle. Okay, we're gonna add the broccoli. Get that broccoli going. Okay, we're going to let that cook for a couple seconds, then we're going to add the eggs. Okay guys, we're back. Alright, we're going to do the, we're going to put the eggs in. I'm going to put the bacon in now, it's really crispy. I wanted to do this at the very end, because, so I didn't have to listen to her. Okay, I'm only going to put a few little pieces in. Okay, okay, that's enough, it's enough. I won't do no more, I promise. Okay. Good. You know, you can be able to taste the bacon, a little bit of bacon that's in there. Okay, so I got this veggie one almost done. So I'm going to put this egg mixture in. Okay. Spread out. Now, normally, 
what I do is I, I cook this ahead of time, the, the veggies, and then I add it to the egg and then put it in. I didn't do that because I'm doing a, a variety of them, okay? And what I do is I let that kind of form around my, my plate or my uh, pan for a second. All right, so then what I do is kind of lift it up. See, I lift it up, drill it in there, let it just kind of go up underneath that omelet or that uh, kind of like it's, like, it's like an omelet, okay? And it, I'm kind of like drying out the, kind of like drying out the, um, the egg. And I don't cook it real high because the one thing I don't like is burning my eggs. I hate it. And I just do this until it's ready. Okay. You know, I was going to tell you about the mushrooms. If you're going to wash the mushrooms and, um, uh, in, in water, make sure you dry them real good. Mushrooms are like a sponge. And if you don't do that, you're going to get soggy mushrooms. Nothing worse than eating soggy mushrooms, let me tell you. Okay, give it a little flip. We're good to go. Now that's going to be flipped one more time, and then I'm going to put the cheese on. I, I'm going to put the cheese on when I do my my um, uh, wrap, okay? I was going to put it on and then put it, but I, I don't want to mess the pan up because I want to keep using the pan, okay? We are ready. Okay, guys. This is a two-egged one, okay? This is going to be a two-egg omelet. Or a two-egg uh, burrito. There's one. Well, I guess it can do both. Okay. And so then all I do is get my cheese. Add my cheese to it. Okay. Just like so. Okay. And then I wrap it. Now, you could, I don't know how you wrap yours, but I kind of just wrap and tuck. Okay. Just like so. I just wrap each side. I'm going to go from this side. This. And then I'm going to wrap it, tuck it. All right? Not done. Because now it goes over here. I toast them. I toast them in the, on the griddle, both sides. And then when they're done toasting, I cool them down, wrap them up, throw them in the freezer. When you go to warm it up in the microwave, they're not going to be soggy because I, I toasted it. Okay, this is what the burrito is gonna look like, okay? Now, what you would do is, you, you would put this on a, a metal rack, you know, so, so it'll cool down, and so they're kind of dry, okay? And then you'd wrap them up, I, I wrap mine in parchment paper and then um, put them in the freezer, but to, you know, however you do it. And then when, when you're done, you throw them in the microwave, okay? And this is what you get. Check that out. So, okay, that's the veggie one. Okay, so now I'm working on a sausage, uh, a sausage one, so We'll be back in a few minutes. Check out that one. Okay, everybody. We're doing, um, I'm doing the sausage one now. And I put onions, peppers, 
sausage, some mushrooms, and this is gonna be a different one, okay? You can add anything you want to these things, whatever you want. You want cauliflower, put cauliflower in there. If you don't want mushrooms, don't put mushrooms in there. It's whatever you want. You're the creator, you make what it, what it is you like. Okay, so I'm gonna put the egg in. You know, I, I was gonna tell you, once these are all done, and you get them all toasted and everything, you could top that with sour cream and, and a salsa, which that's what I like to do. But um, I mean, it, it, that's if you want to put something on. You want ketchup on, put ketchup on it. You know, it's whatever. So I'm gonna do the egg bit again. This could be another two or three burritos. And then uh, when this is done, I'll meet you back at the counter. Okay, see you in a bit. Okay, we're at our, our next batch of burritos. Now, like I said, you put as much as you want in these things. You know, if you got little, little smaller kids, make smaller, smaller uh, burritos. No matter. I kind of shortchanged this one, so I'm gonna take this one over here. Okay, better. Alrighty. So I'm throw some cheese on there. And I'm just gonna do a little because I'm gonna put a, a little bit of American cheese on there too. Why? Because that's what I want to do. And if I want to do it, I'm gonna do it. Just like you should do it. You want to do it? Do it. It's gonna taste good. This one's sausage. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing. Now listen. I use a flat griddle, okay? I use a flat griddle over here, and I put nothing on it. It's gonna be just dry, okay? You don't wanna butter this or anything like that. You wanna, you wanna cook it dry. So I'm just gonna wrap it, throw it on. These are, these are the large ones. You could do the small ones. Um, but they, they, I, I'll tell you the truth. I went to the store and I bought these, uh, tortillas and guess what? The bigger ones were cheaper than the little ones and they had the same amount in it. So what do you think I'm going to buy? I'm going to buy the, the better deal. So I bought big ones, but then you're saying, okay, Karen, they might be bigger, but you're using more food. Well, yeah, you're right, but that's the way it goes. Hey, I'm a penny pincher when it comes to food. That's why I grow most of it. Okay, I wrap it, roll it. Stick it on the griddle. Dry griddle, I put nothing on it. It's gonna be nice and toasty, but then when you microwave it, it's gonna get a little soft, okay? But it's not gonna be soggy. Okay, so I'll be back. Now let that cook. This is the western one. That's the ham, um, peppers and onions. So we'll make about three of them. We'll top it with the cheese. <clears throat> What a beautiful egg. Almost 
ました。Okay, guys, it's all done. They're mostly all cooled down. Um, I did, uh, if you look over here, I did ham, bacon, veggie, um, uh, sausage, and now I'm wrapping them. So what I do is, I take, I do it in parchment paper, but anyways, I just make a pouch. I just wrap it, white with the paper a little bit, Fold it up, and then I mark it on, on the ends. This one is um, bacon, so I mark it on the end. Okay, so then what I do is I take some freezer baggies, um, and uh, I just load them in there. When I'm hungry, pull one out of the freezer, nuke it, and I got myself a breakfast burrito. Okay, so look it. If you like this recipe, um, give me a thumbs up, a like, maybe a share, tell your friends, uh, and I'm also on YouTube. And uh, one more thing, thank you so much for uh, all the, the, the comments and, you know, the funny comments you give me and, and that you're really trying, trying the uh, recipes. Like I said, it's easy. It's, it's fun and easy. Get the family involved. So, hey, have a good day. Have a good night. Whenever you're watching this. Have a good one. Catch you later. Hey, um, one more thing. Um, I have someone I wanted to say hello to, and uh, her name is um, Dale Sells. Uh, hi, Dale. One day you're gonna come over here and you're gonna eat this food. So we'll catch you all later. See you later. There's not enough white. Every freaking white in the house is on. They'll have to deal with it. Are you done? Yes. Are we ready? No, not yet. Meanwhile, I'll get some cheese around. Nice, scuff. I'm telling you. There. Hey, scuff. Nothing more irritates me. Okay. All right, so. You can stop anytime you want. I mean, these are about ready. God dang, that's hot. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh, I do have a spatula. I guess I could have used that, which I'm going to right now. Thank you.